the sixth day of Christmas, my true love sent to me. Alright, Super Fucking Mario Land. Goddamn, in fucking Egypt Land. Because, you know, Mario visits all these fantastical, wonderful places that, you know, made up with whimsy and such, and then they were like, oh, by the way, he goes to Egypt and uh, studies Egyptology. And I'm like, I don't think that's a real branch of science. And you're like, well, fuck you, because you're an asshole. Goddamn. I don't even know why I make these videos for you if you're going to be so fucking hateful to me. I swear. My god, nothing can kill him. Of course, the fire, you don't get fireballs in this game, because you got to shoot this little bouncy ball. Son, you do get the star, man. Of course, they changed the music to this fucking can can bullshit. Like, how. I mean, I can't. I can't write no lyrics to this shit. It, it's fucking ridiculous. I'm gonna have to get up and fucking dance with a skirt on. Oh, uh, I guess I could fill this space in. Uh, how about, uh, pot at me? There we go. Fuck you. Alright, we're just a bebopping. Fucking bees. I want Mario to go two consecutive fucking seconds without having to run into bees carrying spears. There's seriously, there's something wrong with the man. I don't know if it's chemical imbalance or some kind of trauma, but he needs to get this shit sorted out before he goes to visit fucking Egypt. Seriously, he ain't got time to study King Tut and Kama when you got fucking bees inside your head throwing spears at you. Lord Jesus. Alright. Almost there. Fuck you. <laughs> I didn't realize I was so angry at Egypt. Probably because this is where Yu-Gi-Oh takes place. God damn it. Jesus fucking Christ, we're in a pyramid. Why the fucking hell are we in a pyramid? It doesn't make any sense to be in a pyramid. Because we're super fucking Mario. Where's my 16th century English style castle? Jesus fucking Christ, we're still in the pyramid. I got killed inside a pyramid. The ceiling's fucking falling in the pyramid. I don't fucking understand. Jesus Christ, we're in the pyramid. I have no fucking clue why we're in a pyramid. Could someone fucking explain why I'm in a pyramid? I'm super fucking Mario. I'm in a pyramid. Not some sort of 16th century Scottish castle with a reptilian guy at the end. I'll kick him in the nuts, kick him in the nuts, kick him in the nuts. I'm still in a fucking pyramid. And here's the boss, and he's already dead. Because stepping on this thing, apparently the boss is rigged with claymores, and he explodes. Also, you don't rig claymores. I was trying to say C4, but I can't fucking talk right. God damn. Yes, this is a very touching scene. Oh, spoilers, she turns into some kind of bug thing and hops away. Isn't that very dramatic? Fucking Daisy. I'm glad you're non-canonical. Alright, we're gonna play on too easy mode. And why? Because I'm too fucking lazy to play on normal mode. Because I'm just trying to get some footage. Also, this game is much more Mario-like, and it tickles my fancy right good. You got you some goon, maybe a tar shell too, ain't gonna be bad. Get you a super mushroom, you'd be set. So I'm feeling more Mario by the second. No fucking, uh, cryptozoology or whatever the fuck I said earlier in this. It's just good old-fashioned Gooma stomping. Um, Bowser's not at the end of kicking nuts, which is terrible, terrible disappointment, but Wario was introduced in this game. And he has a big old set of nuts to kick. Also, look at the heel in the background. It's so fucking angry. The entirety of Super Mario World is fucking Zantac. I think. Or maybe I'm thinking of that shit that stops heartburn. Also, they changed my invincibility music again. Some kind of techno ray bullshit. I don't need fucking MC Hammer. I want my fucking I'm Invincible song. Goddamn. They got to take everything I love and destroy it. I'm the fucking Indian in that commercial. I'm shed one big old fucking tear. Alright, this game lets you pick what world you go to, but we're going to the world that is basically a giant Mario robot that you go inside of because 
It's fucking crazy. Fucking Dante's gonna be in this shit. Dun, 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 dun. I'm inside a giant Mario. I'm inside a fucking giant Mario. Someone tell me, will you please tell me why I'm inside a giant Mario? Oh my god. He's fucking Mario. He's fucking Mario. He's fucking Mario and he's huge. He's fucking Mario. He's fucking Mario. He's fucking Mario. He's fucking Mario. And he's really, really fucking big. I can't get over how fucking big he is. Also, my timing in creating this song is not exactly up to par, Jesus Christ. Also, carrots give you bunny ears with such you float, which is terrible. I mean, I'll accept that having a raccoon tail and ears lets you fly, but bunny ears letting you fly is just my suspension of disbelief has been taken out back behind the tool shed and shot 34 times in the face with a shotgun. Fucking double shotguns. Yeah. And yeah, you know what I'm talking about. Get you a little bit of stopping power on that shit, but I think I'm getting ahead of myself. Or behind myself. I think there's two of me standing side by side and we're punching each other in the mouth. Also, the next level takes place in the giant Mario's crotch. And guess what? It's full of balls. Isn't that very funny? Do you see what they were doing? Do you see in fucking Nippon land? They were fucking all hopped up on green tea and opium and they cranked this shit out. Also, I don't know if they enjoy opium in Nippon land, but I don't give one fuck about being actually historically accurate. I'd go elaborate on how little the fuck I give, but, you know, I'm sure you all know the exact quantity. You know, the metric. But, um, yeah. So, giant ball level. Also, look at this Goomba, son. His fucking eyebrow. He thinks he's Groucho fucking Marx. God damn, get him a cigar and say the world is day. He'll be tickled. Oh, Christ. But, um, yeah, what the hell? Jesus, Lord, help me, etc. I think we've had just about enough of this. <laughs>